guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Sunday, uh, the 25th. Yeah. Tomorrow, June is eight months old. Yeah, you are. Anyways, I wanted to hop on here real quick to share um, an update on my Halloween countdown and also an update on my scarf. I just thought I'd hop on here. I actually worked on it a lot yesterday, the scarf. This is the scarf pattern by Pamela at Pamela's Adorian Crochet. It is a video tutorial that's free on her YouTube channel. And I'm using a mandala ombre cake. It's kind of falling apart now. That's called uh, Mantra. And I'm using an H hook, which is a five millimeter. So it's her newest uh, scarf pattern that she put out uh, a tutorial for. And I think it's just called Bubble Stitch Scarf or something like that. But uh, I'll have it linked below if you want to check it out. And I'm just, I got pretty good distance. Not I'm not halfway done yet, but I'm getting there. So here it is. <laughs> so far so I started down here at this blue and then it's gone up so it is a repeat so a six row repeat I think you do five rows of the cluster stitch repeat <laughs> and then you do a bobble row so I've got I think seven of them one two three four five six seven yeah. and I'm, I'm working on this now I just pulled out some stitches <laughs> but I'm getting there so that's all that I have the rest of this cake that I made my ear warmer out of, and then I have another full cake, so I got plenty enough yarn to make that scarf yeah. for myself. That's this for myself project. <laughs> and then my Halloween countdown, I'm almost done with it, and I was thinking that I was done crocheting, but I forgot all about the pumpkins. So I pulled out some orange yarn, and I'm going to grab a scrap ball of a green, and I'm going to make some pumpkins for the bottom of it, probably tonight, whenever she lays down. Hey. Um, but I did hot glue all the numbers on there today. If you're on my Instagram, you would have seen that, because I shared um, a picture earlier today of it. So, I did hot glue all the numbers on there, like I said. <laughs> These numbers my sister made out of the thin felt. I don't know if it's got a special name. It's like felt, but it's like pressed. So, it's really thin and sturdier than regular felt. So, there's number one. And then all the numbers. Well, I can't see. <laughs> so I'm just trusting they're in there. All the numbers are on all the pockets. So, I am going to make the pumpkins, like I said. And they're going to go along this last row underneath the windows and beside the door. <laughs> I'm going to make uh, some pumpkins there. And I thought I might look to see if I can maybe find like a cat applique to put on there. And then the um, pattern has like stitched on bats. But I want to try to maybe find like a witch applique or something to put on the moon. I thought that'd be cool. Like a witch on a broom. <laughs> and uh, the little ghost will be in each of the pockets. As like on the day October 1st, he'll be up here and Jesse can take the candy out and then put the ghost in there. And then each day as he takes the candy out, he can move the little ghost to each of the pockets. Uh, that's the plan. So I'm also going to end up lining it with some fleece. I already have some on hand that will fit this. It's going to be like a cream color. Um, and I'm just going to hot glue it. I'm not going to sew it. <laughs> I'm just going to hot glue it along the sides and then hope that that looks decent enough. <laughs> it doesn't need to be perfect because it's just for a home project, you know. And then I already got the dowel. Devin has to cut it and sand it for me to the right uh, size. And then we got to figure out how to hang it to the wall <laughs> with the dowel. Um, but yeah, so it's almost done. Got the numbers on there, and so I need to do the pumpkins, get them on there, and then I need to line it. Devin needs to hang it up for me, and then I gotta stuff it full of candy. <laughs> but uh, that's gonna be fun. I'm gonna shop for that candy this uh, coming weekend whenever I go grocery shopping. I'm gonna try to make look, get uh, a little good variety of candy so it's not the same thing every day. What do you think? You can't use it yet, you have to get bigger. But next year, you and Brother can share it. So that's what I've been working on today. I glued all those numbers on there, which took a little while. I still got my hot glue gun out. These are all my glue sticks and my guns laying over here. I gotta wrap it up and stick it back in here. It fits in here. I have just a Dollar Tree glue gun and I've had it for years and it's never caught on fire or anything. So I just keep them in that little bag. But yeah, so that's what I've been working on today. <clears throat> We're feeling mostly better still. A little... Why did you throw all your stuff? We're still just a little sick, you know. It's just, it's, it's, uh, we're at the tail end of it, so. I'm glad for that because I'm tired of being ill and I'm tired of taking care of sick kids. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I made a chicken dinner in the crock pot today. It was uh, chicken and stuffing. Very delicious. If I can think about it, I'll link the recipe down below that we used. Um, I think it's on my Pinterest, so I think I can't link it. Uh, let me know what you guys made for dinner today. And I guess I will see you guys in another video. Maybe tomorrow because I'm supposed to be getting some mail this week, but I don't know if it's any happy mail. I think it might just be stuff I ordered. <laughs> And I am getting a box soon from Jen. Uh, we did a Halloween swap last year. I'm trying to remember if last year was the first year we did it. 
So I can't remember now. I'm not sure. But um, we did a Halloween swap for scrap balls and then other, some other little knickknack things. And then uh, we talked to, about it this year and we're doing it again this year. She already got my box yesterday. And mine's supposed to come tomorrow or Tuesday. So I'm excited about that. And uh, it's almost October. So I'll be doing that every day on my Vlogtober plus whatever we do around the house. And I've already been finding some family events to go to, trunk retreats and things. So October is going to be a busy, fun month. Hopefully we can stay healthy. <laughs> And get out and have some fun. Whoops, you about to call somebody? Let's cancel that. <clears throat> Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and hop off here so I can get her entertained. She doesn't like sitting here right now, she's chewing on her phone. But uh, I'll see you guys in another video. Bye, guys.